years ago, we planted these pineapples. And as you can see, they are growing nicely over here. The land is mostly sand. So these pineapples are growing. What you see over there is a pineapple on there is already bearing fruit. I just harvested one. I'm going to show you. So I'm going to have not had it. I haven't eaten it yet. I'm waiting for it to get really juicy. Then I'm going to show you. So this is the one I harvested. This one. I harvested this one two days ago. We'll try to cover it with these scrolls so that way people don't get too attracted to them and, and harvest them without us. Because we planted them, we need to be the ones harvesting, not other people. So this is the pineapple. Pineapple right here. Let me see if I can get. Now pineapples are <laughs> they're dangerous because they're kind of very sharp. Okay, so as you can see right here, we got pineapple right under here. But we cover it up just to protect it from eyes. Eyes. So this is the one I have. So it's gonna grow again. Now over here we got cassava. We just planted them a few weeks ago and it's already growing. Cassavas grow good here. And these cassavas are sweet. So you can eat it with dumbo. You can eat it by themselves. Or you do fufu. Or you do bitter cassava. Anything cassava is, not, is very useful over here. So everybody needs to have a cassava farm. So that's the rest of the pineapple right here. So I don't know how they planted it. They put a, I think they had cassava here already. So they couldn't plant it between here. So they planted it over there. They did the planting right here. That's the house there. And then we got pineapple right here again. So we got most of the pineapple here. Yeah. Pineapple here and more cassava here. I got all this land, but I built a small house. So I got more land to do a lot of things with. I got the one and a half acres, but I think I built on um, probably one lot. And this is the pineapple. This is the pineapple. Pineapple all here. You must love the sand. Let's go on the sand. Cassava, they just dug out some cassava, so they're going to replant these cassava sticks. So we got enough pineapple over here. And the pineapple is sweet over here. Pineapple is very sweet. And we got this. This other end, they still got cassava in here. So they're gonna dig up all the cassava. I think she ducked it up today, that's what she did today. So once this, everything is ducked up, they're gonna clean this place up. I left like the area clean. I got some coconut right there, coconut. I got more coconut. Let me see, I got, that's a coconut right. That's a coconut right here too, coconut trees. I got the whole area, coconut trees. Here's the pineapple, very nice fruit. Got some sugar cane right here, sugar cane. Some sugar cane, yeah, coconut again right here, coconut. And coconut grows very well here too, so. And coconut right here. So the whole line, you can see over here, the whole line is coconut, yeah. This is the cassava. So cassava is so useful over here because you can eat the cassava leaf. You can take the cassava and make fufu, make um, farina. You can eat the cassava by itself. You can make dumbo. I'm telling you, cassava is so useful. Yep, just like the palm. See, this is the palm. The palm too is useful. So the palm, you can get the palm nut. Actually, the palm, you can get palm cabbage. We can eat that. The palm nut, you can make palm butter, the palm canna, 
people will eat that. The palm kind of got oil, we eat that. The palm kind of can use it as fire. So, so much use out of these things. Yeah, so that's the update to my pineapple. Uh, about two years ago, I planted the pineapple. Uh, update to that. Update to the development. Very nice. And let me end this with the sunset. Beautiful, beautiful sunset. Yes. Come on. All right. This is it.